Speaking of team, to me, all of us here together, we're a team, right? We all got the same questions. We're all sitting around the same campfire. We got TEDx printed on the front of our jersey. We're a team. And this room that we're in here today, this is like the locker room, right? This is the locker room. This is where we come before the big game to talk about strategies and to talk about tactics and to talk about set plays that we're going to use outside on the field in the big arena to win at the game of life. And now all we got to do is find out whose mom is going to wash the jerseys after the game, right? <laughs> and we got to find out whose mom is going to wash the jerseys after the game. And also, because we're a team, obviously, after this thing, we're all getting into the shower together, right? <laughs> we're a team, right? We're like this. Save water. Shower together. And I hear that you're supposed to open up these things with a, with a statistic, with a fact. And I got one for you. It's not pretty, but it's true. Get this. On average, after about three minutes, we're going to lose most of the people watching at home. Right? We're going to lose them to the next Facebook notification, lose them to the next YouTube video, lose them to whatever it is that they feel has more value than the moment we're sharing here together. And we're all guilty of this, right? We're all guilty of disrespecting the potential of today for a potentially better tomorrow. Right? We lean into the future or fall back into the past, hoping that it will hold more significance than the present moment ever could. And I don't want to get into a big discussion about the power of the moment. Right? There's some world-class thinkers that have de dedicated their life to that, and rightly so. And by the way, we only got about two more minutes left. So all I want to do in the locker room today for us as a team is tell you guys a story. Because stories, unlike abstract information, have the power to stay with us for the rest of our lives, even if we only heard them once. And stories have the unique ability to help children fall asleep, but to help grown-ups wake up. It's a story about a photo wall, about a photo wall that belongs to you. Because each and every photo on that photo wall represents one day of your life. Imagine that, a wall full of pictures, all the days of your life, side by side by side. The day you were born, to the first day of school, the first time you fell in love, first kiss, the beautiful days, and the hard days. All the days of your life are there. And now close your eyes and imagine you walk along that wall of pictures and look at each and every day of your life. And now ask yourself honestly, how do you look during the days of your life? Do you love what you do each and every day? Do you show open emotion? Do you cry honestly? And do you laugh loudly? And are you vulnerable? Do you make a difference for other people even if they cannot make a difference for you? Are you a team player that helps others? And do you make really good decisions every day? And then suddenly, you come up on a spot on your photo wall where the pictures just suddenly stop. And the last picture you see is a picture of you yesterday. And after that, the wall is white, empty, bleak, and untouched. You have the ability and you have the opportunity to create each and every new day, starting today, according to your very best life. And now promise yourself and promise the child inside that you will create days and that you will create photos that truly inspire you, full of integrity and joy, and full of love and service, full of courage and fearlessness just like the child inside. Because there will come a day, and I promise you this, when you are too old, and when your body's too weak, and when you're too frail to walk along that wall of pictures and look at each and every day of your life. But the generations that follow you, and the generations that will continue to look up to you, your children, 
and their children and their children and their children will walk up and down your wall of pictures forever and ever and they will look at every single picture every single day of your life closely make sure that every single day of your life starting today represents your highest standards and your very best self of total devotion open emotion the difference real teamwork and truly good decisions make sure that the people that are closest to your heart walk along that wall and think to themselves wow what a beautiful life and what a wonderful personality and what a kind and honest heart and i hope for each and every one of you that you start doing that today not yesterday not tomorrow but today thank you so much for listening thank you for your trust thank you for staying with me longer than most and thank you honestly for today <laughs>